it's Friday. Welcome to the video. You. It's 42 degrees, so. Yeah, yeah, I know. I don't like it either, but uh, 67 tomorrow and 71 Sunday. That'll be nicer. Ford owners unite. Oh, I'm on my way out on Friday. It's like 56 degrees, but. I'm done. That's what matters. All right, so I'm going to head over. I just got home, by the way. I'm going to head over to our grocery store known as Acme and uh, get some of the forms for these hikes that we have to do. Kenan and Taylor and I, supposedly, I haven't confirmed everything with them yet, but we're going to take one of these walks today. I mentioned it before. If we take 12, uh, we get 12 extra credit points for ecology, second year which is awesome. So, uh, not that ecology is a hard class we need extra credit in, but hey, 12 free points, you'd be an idiot not to take it. So I'm gonna go get the forms that have the places we have to go walk and the addresses and where we sign off when we did them and stuff like that. Uh, so, talk to you in a few minutes. Get her done. I can't turn the camera all the way around. And there we go. So I got the three forms. I got donuts and I got cider because it's pretty much fall here, 61 degrees. Uh, so, what better way to kick off fall than uh, donuts and cider, eh? Well, we're at Taylor's house. I don't think I filmed Kenan's arrival, but here he is. And we're going on one of the walks now. I've got our snacks back here and there they are. So, I guess we'll have to text him because he can't hear anything. All right, we are now tailgating on the back of the M5 with donuts and cider. Uh, I know tailgating isn't a real American activity, but uh, we'll get her done. <laughs> How's the donuts, guys? They're good. They're real good. We just polished off a whole box, and most of that. Oh, yeah. That's pretty good. All right, guys, this is number one of, I think, 12 that we're going to do. We have thrown out our waste. And uh, what is it, 1.7 miles? And none of us have the sheet. We don't do. actually know. Oh, do you? I do. Yeah. We gotta figure out what trail it is. All right, we got Hampton Hills Spring Hollow Trail, 1.6 miles, rated as a three out of three for being difficult. Doesn't look real difficult, but no, we'll let you know. All right, so we found one of these. I don't know what it actually is. No, but do, neither do I. Yeah. It's green. Some kind though. of seed. All right, Taylor. And it's my second favorite color. Uh, <laughs> Somewhere back there. You didn't hit anything alive, so that's probably good. All right, Taylor, a hundred bucks if you climb that. One hundred dollars right now. I don't have the type of shoes to do it. You don't I have could, the type of shoes. There's, there's oh, that's tree. the problem. There's trees everywhere. Yeah, I've though, never so seen you wear any of those shoes. Yeah, I. Yeah. Well. Wow. It's kind of hard to take. Oh, we've got a ton of stairs now. Taylor, how's it going? Good. Ken? It's going. It's going. It's 1.6 miles. I have no way of knowing how far we are. We should have used an app for this, Ken. And there's got to be an iPhone app that. Yeah, but we don't that, have any signal right now. Oh, there's got to be 3G here. We're on AT&T. It's the strongest American network. We have three bars. Oh, that's better when we started. So I guess there isn't anything in the parking lot. Or Kenan's phone is dickered. I have which four. is possible. Beat that. Here's the second one of the day. We did our 1.6. That was good. So this is 1.2. It's it's a different difficulty level. And uh, it says uh, keep right, so right, keep we'll right do that. There, so we took the extra path to come down and take a look at lock number 28. Um, I've walked this path probably 10 times and we've never actually come down here. Lock Be careful, stay back from edge. This is uh, we'll deep block. A lot of you guys probably don't even know what these are for. But um, bringing ships and stuff, little craft yeah, through here, uh, they had to adjust the water levels. I got it on the recording. Oh, whatever. Cheers. <laughs> the hell are you guys arguing about? He Nothing. said this was lock 48. I don't know. Uh, I said, I Taylor, you don't argue about things you don't know. Probably can't read that on camera. Ohio Erie Canal opened 1827. That's like 40 years before this old duff was born. We are done with signs over here. This is a 1.2. How'd it go, Taylor? I thought it was pretty good. Pretty good! Yeah, so now we're gonna go find somewhere to eat food. We're parked, and here's a new Cayenne. One of Kenan's favorite cars. Looks nice! It's, a Volkswagen it's 
What? <laughs> what? What did Taylor? We didn't even. It's a double blow. Yeah, I think it looks good. Uh, hey guys, hey, we haven't uh, talked a whole lot. Cannon's. He's working over here at the bank. <laughs> Uh, putting all his monies in, so I'm just sitting in here. Look at this. I've got heated seat on low, sport is turned on because it makes the throttle response sharper, it just feels better. His heated seat is on, we've got the heat on 75. You've got this thing set to warm air. It is, uh, let's get an exterior temperature going on here. It is 57 degrees outside, it's just dicked. That's fine and dandy though. You guys know what YouTuber this is uh, on page 32 in this month's episode of Car and Driver. Uh, I think a couple of you do because I have been recommended uh, to watch the channel. That's pretty awesome. Made it to Car and Driver. Whoops. <laughs> I guess I could. <laughs> Alright, 410 is good. We're back downtown. Uh, one week ago we were right here looking at that BMW 8 series. Um, we've done better this time. Yeah, I'm not again, talking about the 5 series. More nice cars have come out of Yeah, I don't know what it is. All of the nice ones are coming out at night. Check this out. The newer Audi oh, R8, and that is that is stunning. I'm not a big, was not a big fan of the old R8, but this, that's a beautiful car. Audi did this one right. And it sucks, because the lighting now is awful, awful. but yeah, that's when they come out now. It sucks. Sweet. We'll go down. What's up guys? We're now back at the house. I was just over at Kenan's for a little bit. I am packing up my things for tomorrow. Information as well as uh, my nuts and my rotors into the trunk. Um, we're going down tomorrow morning at 8.30. I'm leaving here at like 7.45. My grandfather's going to follow me down and drive me back. I'll have to drive carefully tomorrow morning. These things flying around in here will not be good. So it'll be good to get those put on. I've needed these for a while, and I finally have them now. So my wheels are filthy. Here, check this out. With uh, brake dust. So I need to go in, tell somebody something on Skype of minimal importance, and then I'll do this. <clears throat> Maybe I should keep those in the winter. It would improve traction. Listen to this door close. Oh man, that is German quality. Sorry, that's weird, I know, but that was always the inside test in my family to tell if a car is a good car. Is I think my grandfather started it, I don't know. You take the door, you close it pretty hard, if it's got a good solid thud to it, that's a good car. That's the Honda. If it rattles, it's a bad car. Pretty good thud. Pretty good thud. Really only the American cars rattle. And unfortunately the Italian ones. With that intrinsic bunch of nonsense, you guys have an awesome night. Thanks so much for watching the video. And I'll talk to you guys tomorrow morning. Early, I'm probably going to feel like crap. Uh, i got to get up at like 7.20 to be there at 7.45. So uh, I'll talk to you guys in the morning. Good night.